we now determine the side lengths uh, A and B of this triangle. Uh, clearly, this triangle is a right triangle as we see a little square uh, connecting these two vertices. So, we can use the trigonometric ratio sine, cos and tan to determine the unknown side lengths as well as the unknown angles. So, first uh, I am going to use the sine of angle A. So, I write down sine of angle A and this equals uh, according to the Sokatova, it is opposite side to angle A to hypotenuse. The opposite side to angle A is A and hypotenuse is uh, C. So, I write down A over C. Now, let us substitute the values. Uh, we know that uh, A is 80 degree. So, this becomes a sine of 80 degree. This is in degrees. And this equals uh, A is, uh, we have to determine A over C is 5. So, we multiply both sides by 5 and determine A. So, A equals uh, 5 times of sine 80. And we plug this into the calculator. And when we do that, we get the value as 4.92. So, we have determined the unknown side length A to be 4.92. We now determine the unknown side length B of this uh, triangle. Uh, for this, I am going to use the cos of uh, angle A. So, I write down cos of angle A. And this equals, uh, according to Sokatova, this is uh, adjacent side to angle A which is B over hypotenuse. Hypotenuse is C. So let me substitute the angle A which is uh, 80 degrees. So therefore this becomes a cos of 80 degree and this equals uh, B over C is 5. So we multiply both sides by 5 so that we get the value of B equals uh, 5 times of cos 80. And when we plug this into the calculator we get the value as uh, 0.87. So this is the value of B. And so we have determined the uh, unknown side lengths uh, A and B of this uh, right triangle.